SSI is constantly looking to improve and streamline production. From the initial design concept to coordinating and planning shop floor processes and procedures at every phase of a project, SSI Ship Constructor 2024 R2.1 provides enhancements to existing tools, adding greater flexibility for stakeholders at every level of the shipbuilding process. A popular wish list request, Ship Constructor now allows for separate mark lines and text within DXF exports for plate nesting. With new enhancements for DXF exporting, Ship Constructor has further automated this process, providing a more seamless workflow from design to production. Setting up the plate nest DXF to categorize what needs to be marked, cut, and etched can take a tremendous amount of time and requires product model information to be accurately transferred to various machinery using DXF formats. With the enhanced plate nest DXF options, the automation of this process now facilitates the optional inclusion of third-party software like Sigma Nest or OmniWin and enables clearer formatting of plate markings onto distinct layers. This information can then be sent to third-party software and used to perform double-sided marking while providing additional options for both mark lines and text where required. This means less time is spent setting up for complex operations, ensures accuracy, provides a clearer distinction between marks on nested parts, and reduces time spent re-entering configuration commands into downstream software. WorkShare Graphic Compare is now found within the core Ship Constructor feature collection and is an efficient way to generate a detailed visual snapshot of the differences between sister ships Using compartments, for example, users can now quickly see parts that are modified between projects A and B or unique to project A. The WorkShare Graphic Compare tool is now available for core Ship Constructor subscribers and provides even more clarity when evaluating and applying engineering change orders across sister ship projects. Tracking changes made within the project catalog is imperative, as these can often have far-reaching downstream impacts on the project. The ability to receive notifications of and track changes from the earliest possible stages can help avoid expensive rework downstream. In this release, Catalog Revisions for Outfitting completes the change tracking development within the project catalog adding to the existing functionality while providing a foundation for a more thorough analysis of the downstream effects of changes to the project when necessary. Profile nest locking allows users to control changes introduced upstream of the nesting process and track what needs to be changed in these nests prior to fabrication. This greatly helps to control and avoid costly rework of cut profile parts which in turn assists in waste reduction and material losses. Profile nest locking can be implemented using the lock manager or directly from the profile nest dialog, providing a user-friendly solution for managers and providing the required notifications for modelers should there be an attempt to change a locked nest. Streamlining production means finding issues ahead of the actual production processes before they affect manufacture, production, and assembly stages. With a range of clash detection tools now available in Ship Constructor, finding issues ahead of time has never been easier. With enhancements to search functionality within both the Clash Palette and Clash Manager, and the ability to include UDA values in search results, finding and categorizing clashes is now just a click away. In addition, clashes can now be filtered based on statuses, meaning modelers and managers can focus on priorities, while hiding less important or resolved clashes both from the dialog grids and the 3D model. Clash logs are now available as smart logs, allowing clash results to be shared as needed, where parts can now be linked, accessed, and located directly from the smart log viewer itself. Defining space allocations is more flexible than ever with the ability to support different profile ends for elbows, this, together with the existing ability to specify offsets, 
means a more flexible and a less error-prone modeling process that reduces the number of steps required to accurately represent the wireway in the 3D model. This enhancement to space allocation parallels the existing functionality for distributed system modeling tools in PIPE and HVAC, providing a more intuitive and user-friendly method of designing these spaces. SSI Nexus now provides all SSI certified training resources in a centralized location on SSI Nexus with access to all video content, tutorials, training materials, and training support. The streamlined access removes the need for trainees to acquire and manage separate MyLearning signup tokens. Users with active subscriptions or a trial account can simply access the SSI Learning tab from the Nexus navigation menu to find these resources and more, without having to manage an external set of login credentials. This makes it easier for both learners and managers to focus on the content, complete onboarding requirements, and ensures a faster path to achieving proficiency as a certified ship constructor user. In addition, the entire SSI training video library is now included with Nexus Search, further enhancing the site as a help resource. Find these features in all ship constructor tools, training, discussions, and downloads at SSI Nexus today.